Hi guys, thanks for checking the video out. Steve Buzzer here, and I'm with Jimbo Jet Golf. Bonjour. So I'm back. I've been in the States for a few weeks. I Not got, long enough. I got back, and I've come straight to France. Straight to France, yeah. Straight to France, and we're going to be undertaking the Tour de Brittany. Yeah, very good, Steve. Tour de Brittany, yeah. There we go. Golf de Ajon d'Or is where we are today. Yeah, stunning. So we've already played a few holes. So we came over on the ferry, Brittany Ferries, and we've just had a bit of a warm-up. So we're on the eighth hole. We're still not that warm, are we? But we're doing a buzz world, are we not? We are. So we're doing a buzz world. So you have to do a high, a low, a draw, a fade, six-hole challenge. And James decided he wants to go first. I, yeah, it's the only time I get the honour, He's pulled. It? You've got no honour. <laughs> this is true. And he's pulled an iron. Yeah. And I think I might pull driver. Well, we'll see which way this works. It's, a, it's 389 metres, so it's a kind of a four, 430-ish yard. I'm not going to lie. Do you put it in metres and I just don't know. 430 yards, basically, Stu. How far? 430. 430. Driver anyway. Am I going to carry this water? Yes. <laughs> Come so. on. Going to call a shot? Uh, am I? Yeah, I want to hit a draw. You can have two if you skim it. Oh, stop it. Oh, sit down. Sit down, ball. Well, that's not ideal. You got some good news. It was a draw. <laughs> Got some bad news. <laughs> Plenty of bad news. This stunning little track here. This is the first time that kind of we've been here, obviously, and it is actually very enjoyable so far. Yeah, no, Golf been different. And we're going to do. So we're going to do. So we're here three days. Yeah. So we'll do a variety. Of challenges. You know what they say about variation, Steve? No. Spice of life. Oh, is it? Mm. <laughs> there you go. So we'll, um, yeah, but we're going to so see every, so like, this will be a buzz world, and whoever wins will get a point. And just, then whatever, just one? Whatever, yeah, and then whatever we do at different locations. Is it everything's worth a point? Everything's worth a point. Sounds wonderful. Half a point for challenges if you do challenges? Yeah. Okay. Or is that too much? No, that's fine. Bonnet de douche. Don't call me a douche. <laughs> Big stick. Oh, I've got some bad news. Mm, hit, hit a bit of woodwork, it might have gone through. Another one? I think you'll be okay there. <laughs> start, start the trip off with a bang. <laughs> <laughs> so you didn't call anything there either? I didn't call anything. No. It's a different flight. Yeah. <laughs> ah, let's get up there and see what's going on. So James, we get to your ball. We did. You're excited that you have a gap. I, I am, because that's, that's the only thing I can be happy about with that shot. But I'm, uh, yeah, it's very playable. I've got 188. 188. And I've got a six time, and I'm going to hit a low one. Yeah. Another shot out of the way. How low are you trying to hit it through here? Well, under the leaves, so under the branches. Using it as like a goal post. Yeah. Yeah, but are you feeling like, ha could you I'm trying to. I'm basically trying to chip it, probably 140, 150 okay. yards, and let it release up there. Okay, just letting the public know. Yeah, did I sound a bit aggressive there? You did, yeah. Sorry. I apologise. You took it as if I didn't think you could do it. I don't think I can. <laughs> oh, he yeah, has. He sucked it a bit. But it's. Let's see if we can get the camera to. Short, but it's fine. Is it short, is it? Oh, that's yeah. actually a good place to be. Let's get up and see where you've ended up. Look at him. He's upset already. He's taken one shot. He's taken one shot. I've kind of got lucky. Kind of. Yeah. I'm going to claim that it hit the tree and actually yeah. chucked it into it. Yeah. It did hit the tree, but it was going in here anyway. I will agree to disagree. Okay. Whatever you say. Right, I'm just saying. Alright. 142. Out of thick hay with a bad shoulder. Yeah, I have got a bad shoulder. 
I've hurt my shoulder, people. Mm. Lost me ball. Excuses are coming out thick and fast. 142 wind, it's like into really. It's isn't it? oh, pretty much, yeah, straight into. Maybe slightly, slightly off the right and into. Yeah, I just feel like it's off. It's probably more off the right. You're just going to try and pump something up around the green. Yeah, I'm going to wedge out. The pin's tucked off this angle. Like, I'm just going to aim at it. Hopefully, it will pull back into the middle. It comes out like a rocket. Brilliant. <laughs> right. It's come out well. That's come out really well. Oh. That's some shot. Oh, here we go. Grandad's getting cranky. Oh, 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 my back. Everything's going. Nice shot, Steve. Drive us up to the green, boy, so I can tap my birdie pad in. <laughs> Unbelievable. So I made it up to the green. Nearly. No, nah, you, you played a good shot from there. Really good miss. Straight up the green. You've probably got a 15 footer. Pretty straightforward little pitch this one. I'm excited, though. Surely you can't mess this one up, can you? Best of contacts release. It's just oh. straight in. Yeah, we're on a, we're on a, we're on a Partland. Ah. That's depressing. Yeah. Not as depressing as having to speak to you. Oh, at the beginning of the trip, come on. Feels like we're about three days in already. Ah. Ah. So we have officially made it to the green. Yeah, just. Both uphill. I might even be a little closer really than I first said. James up the hill. It's gonna, I reckon it's gonna come off his right a little bit. Yeah, he's seen the same, it hasn't. Oh. Well, we go a bit. Yeah, me too. You can have that one. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Whoa! Oh, that's disappointing. <laughs> disappointing bogey, but. Yeah, you're quite happy with it. Such a nice looking view behind Steve, not with him in it necessarily. But lovely little course. So you've literally got off the ferry a couple of hours ago. Drove here, a few warm ups, and now Steve's got this to go to ahead. <laughs> <laughs> this would be heartbreaking. It was always going to happen, wasn't it? You are such a oh, slimy. You wanted to use a different word then, didn't you? Toe rag. A little toe rag. Nice birdie, Steve. Thank you. Very good. I'm impressed. You used two shots, though, so you technically are winning the. Doesn't matter. You're winning the battle. No, I won the battle. You haven't lost the war yet. Not yet. It's already all over. <laughs> Whole trip, I win. Yep, let's go in. So we're on the ninth. This is our second hole of this challenge. 470 meters, so 510 yards. Oh, 520 yards. Yeah, 520. 520. Wind. Just wind off the right. I guess a quite a nicely framed hole this one, straight up. Straight up the fairway there. Just in front of the club out of the hole. It's just drifting a little right. It's fine. Yep. Yeah. Another grimace. Oh man. I'm the new tiger. Yeah, but that's where you're not grimacing when you hit a good one. Oh. Hit a bad one and then grimace. He had a broken leg. Leave the poor man alone. Right. Two behind, not 
two behind, I make birdie. Should have called a shot then really, shouldn't I? Yeah, I'm going high. Fuck, he's rattling through them. It's high but a bit to the right. Oh, it's saying hard. Oh, Steve. <laughs> so we've got to James's ball. He's here. I think he must have landed in that tree. How far you got? 260. So 260. And the boy's excited because it's going to be the quickest anyone's ever got through their shot. Yeah. Fade. <laughs> <laughs> He's literally gone through every single one. Yeah, I haven't hit it yet though. No, nah, true, true. The problem is, like with me, I've got to hit this, I've got to hit low fade as well. Yeah. This could double cross and be so you out think, of town, right? So Left. You, out of town? Wow. A double double cross. A double double cross, it's the clubhouse. Great viewing, but probably stops the trip. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for your hospitality. Here's the ball. I'm not getting there, am I? Uh, not onto the surface. Low fade. My least fade. Low fade. fade. Got one iron. Oh, that's a great shot. It's just right at the green, though. Right of the green, you think? Yeah. Definitely got the right. definitely got the movement. And James, James, congratulations! Was quite quick, wasn't it? You used all your shots. <laughs> kind of ruins the concept in a way. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm playing a buzzword, and you're just playing a normal six-hole challenge. Five. <laughs> Five, four, four. Oh, you, that was your opportunity there to do it in French, you, you're fluent. Oh, cat. <laughs> cat. Depends uh, where you are, how you pronounce it, though. Does it? Brittany's different. Down, kind of, south of France, they pronounce numbers and well, everything differently. Oh, do they? Yeah. It was not it's, like, it's regional, isn't it? So you get, like, accents at home. Yeah. It's very similar here, but we wouldn't necessarily pick it up. Oh. Good to know. Oh. That's why we pay you the big bucks. Well, I'm up here. Okay, Steve's ball. Absolutely fine. 216. 216. The only issue you've got is you've got to hit this, well, is getting it high enough to get over that tree and get the distance to get there. I don't think that's, I, I think 7 iron almost gets there today. Yeah. You're almost downwind here, I think. Yeah. I don't think carrying it's a problem. I don't feel like I should play a shot now on. See, I'm gonna go high six. Is that like a I don't wanna say it, but a Cornish high five. <laughs> <laughs> oh for not good. I nearly so, swore sorry I nearly, for... I nearly swore then that I'm so sick of seeing you do that. Oh, you should be, you should be saying Steve, you're right. Just wait until you hit a bad shot and end it, alright? Alright. It's not as bad as he's making out. A little heavy. Turning to the left. Bunker. I'm not, with that strike. You call it. You call it. I'm not letting you have that. No. I think it was a bit heavy. I caught it a bit. So, try, so by trying to hit up on it, you know, trying to like extend my body, I lost the contact. Yeah. I'm not in the worst of positions, but doesn't count. Doesn't count. Still, still got your shot, Les. <laughs> <laughs> James, just short of the green. This is interesting. Above the old feet here. Yeah, you get this up and down, and you'll be feeling very confident. You'll be feeling a little better. You'll be feeling very good. Good. 
good contact. Hop forward. Dug again, haven't it? Yeah. Stopped a little quicker than I wanted. Yeah, I think you could have. It, I know it's. Could have flown it a bit further. Yeah, it's slightly tough when the ball's above your feet because you don't know if it might come out it a bit hot. With less spin on it. Mm. Didn't know, did it? Didn't know. Be happy though. It was a great strike. What about strike, yeah. Charlie Hopper. <laughs> Okay, so you get to the green. Steve's actually in like the perfect position here for having missed it. He's got kind of a 20 yard bunker shot. Sam's really, really nice in these bunkers as well. Nice and fine. Just like Steve. Fine. Nipped it. Oh. That was one we were talking about earlier, where we just can't spin out of a bunker. No. <laughs> that, that strike sounded really spinny. I thought that was going to go dump. And it didn't. <laughs> no, it didn't. Yeah. So there we got a nice little, nice little scenario here. So I've gone a little further past. Oh, Li little downhill. It sounds a bit harsh, but I was quite relieved it didn't spin up. <laughs> oh, that's, that's a nice attitude <laughs> to have. Sporting, I know, but... Help I can get the evenings it. will be quiet here. Lots of lovely things you could do, but we'll be. Uh... <laughs> this isn't moving much. No, this is up the hill. This is what you it's like. Really straight. Surely I can't move this. Oh, there we go. Oh! He will be mortified if I hold mine now. Oh, James, I, it looked good. You can have that one. Thanks. Makes you feel any better. A little off the right? Yeah. Oh, it's done to here. It's a good effort. It, it wasn't actually, but... Uh. Take it away. Disappointing that, isn't it? It's quite a makeable par five, that. Yeah. Hole number three of this challenge. Hole ten on the course. Pretty straight, isn't it? Yeah, straight down there. 356 meters. Plan yard, Steve. So that's like you add 35 onto that, so you got about 390. Oh, what a mate! Your mass is good. It is. Yeah. Oh, me again. Yeah, it is. Still, your honour. You going? Driver? I'm no. You not think it's driving? No. Five wood? Uh, whatever you want to hit, mate. I'm not hitting your ball. Tell you what mm. I'm going to do. Because I enjoy doing it more so than anything else. You're going to hit three wood? I'm going to cut my three wood. Ah. Oh, so there's Graham in the buggy just following us around, making sure we behave ourselves. Absolutely, yeah. Organises our trips for us. Organises our trips? Organises trips, he's the organiser. Well, he organises the trips as well, any trips. He's our guy, you can't use him. <laughs> yeah, he, you're not allowed. Let's cut three words. Over cutting a little. Nice ball. Fair way, isn't it? I don't know, it just looked like it was drifting away. Yeah, he's free to do what he wants. Even before the end of part one. I, I am going to hit a cut because I feel like it. Oh. It doesn't matter, does it? Doesn't matter, mate. Doing, Tell mate? us, though. We'd, we'd like to know what you're doing. <laughs> He's overcut that one a little bit. Trees? James. You know you can't it's good cut control it. control there, isn't it? Really? Oh, sorry. How far you got? So James has kind of got away with it. There was room out here, though. Not sure he may have clipped this tree and it might have dropped there. I don't know. Running at absolutely 
smashed in the He's <laughs> crying. So, one of these shots, it looks quite tough on camera, but I don't think it really is. I not get it there, that's the problem. Right, so I've got to go quite high, and I've got 190 basically. Is it that far? Yeah. Well, it was a hard seven. It's a bit bad. So we're going in the opposite direction of the par five. So you're into the wind. Yeah. Into the left. I've just got to get it up and as far down. Well, you got okay. five. Seven. Seven. Oh, so you're just. I'm just going to try and hit it hard. I think if you give it a good belt and it takes a big bounce, it oh, gets yeah. onto the front. We'll see in a minute, won't we? Yeah, why don't you just hit it and we can then discuss it afterwards. Good strike. I'm going to zoom through this little gap. The short right. Short right, so you don't see that in the gap, unfortunately, people. That's a pretty good shot. It's a good strike. I think that's as close as you were going to get it with that club. Yeah. And it only just cleared. Yeah, it was, it was touch and go, that one. Proper shot. Proper shot. Took it well, though, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> we'll back strike. Uh, Steve just in the right semi. Is it a monster of a shot here with his three wood? 115. Into the wind. That has some glitter. It's a beautiful lie, but it's not really what you want with a wedge. You don't know whether it's going to kind of fly or. I think it will. You think it will? Yeah. It's like a little 50, isn't it? Like a controlled one. I'm thinking 54. Yeah? Yeah. I suppose it depends how you want to flight it, really, it's doesn't it? It's going to punch it a little bit. There's a little false edge front on it though, isn't there? I think, yeah, I think there's quite a bit of dead ground there. I think that's... It's like 115 pins, so it... I think it works. I do think the ball's going a little It enters little the further. green at 105, doesn't it? And stops and spins back to 100. I could see this. Yeah. See it going in. Zoom in on the flag. going to drift back. <laughs> Start. <laughs> Stay in this pitch fight. It's kind of landed where I said. Yeah, I just did, didn't go. Didn't think it would hop. Yeah. Right. See, I, again, I'd have seen that as like a probably a low fifty. Yeah. Everyone off the, off the fairway. Totally agree. I just didn't want to try and be clever. And you then don't want to go long for me. No. You're better off being yeah. on the green than not. Yeah, it's a sensible play by Centleman. Centre. Oh, by a Centleman. I can't even say it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but water, yeah. club. Like he said, he pushed it just a tad. Pretty good line. Where it got to go there? Great shot. That's very nice. Thanks, Steve. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> That's given as well. You've done what you needed to do. After not the best of tee shots, recovered really well. Well done. Thank you. So hey, where's yours? <laughs> oh yeah, you just don't bother picking them up. That's your problem. Oh, that's a catch. <laughs> Tell you what, could have done with you in the slips yesterday in the old cricket, Good. England, South Africa. It was a drop catch in the slips. I was sat with your dad and he was slating it. It didn't look that easy. My they... dad very hard on the slip. I was going to say, it didn't look that easy. It was a diving oh, I effort. I went in the slips once. My brother was bowling and he I used to love it down at third man. <laughs> you know, having a drink down there. That's where you hide the crap, Bowl isn't it? a few it? overs and then go down there and he brought me up in the slip. I've never been so scared. <laughs> I hated it. I quite like it in the slips. did not enjoy that experience. It's, it's quite sociable. You can chat quite a lot. Well, I'm not sociable, I'm afraid of balls. That's not the, that's not the sound bite that you want to be sending out to the world. Up the hill. Okay. Take it away. Best of parts then. There we go, part one. So the Tour de Brittany has started. 
I'm one up. No, you're not. You're two in front. Even better. Come to Brittany. <laughs> <laughs>